Ukraine's southern ports woke up to more carnage on Thursday morning. Russian missiles hit Odessa and Mykolaiv overnight. It was the third successive night of airstrikes on the region. Officials said at least 21 people were wounded in the latest attacks. Russia has stepped up strikes on the Black Sea ports after withdrawing Monday from a deal to allow Ukrainian grain exports. On Thursday, it turned up tensions again, saying any ships heading to Ukraine's ports could be considered targets. That might scupper Kyiv's plan to resume exports via Romanian waters. It's all reviving fears over global food supplies and prices, with grain stocks and port infrastructure also destroyed in the latest attacks. On Thursday, EU foreign policy chief Josep Borrell said it would all create a huge food crisis in the world. He said European countries would have to help find new routes for Ukraine's grain shipments. If the sea route is closed, we will have to increase the capacity of exporting Ukrainian grain through our ports, which means a bigger effort for the neighbour Ukraine. They will have to contribute more, opening the borders and facilitating transport. Ukraine described the latest attacks as Russian terror and said they were meant to disrupt global food supplies. There was no comment from Moscow. Speaking a day earlier, Russian President Vladimir Putin had said he wasn't against reviving the grain export deal. But he said its collapse was down to Western countries not fulfilling promises over Russian exports. On Thursday, the strains were starting to show on global markets. Prices for wheat climbed again on fears over long-term disruption to supplies.